Welcome back everyone to another crazy Fortnite XP glitch. We are now Friday. This is going to be the second out of three videos of the day. And in this Fortnite XP glitch map, we are going to be covering two different maps. It's going to be really, really overpowered. And I cannot wait to show you guys every single one of these buttons. Now, as you guys know, we are the weekend. So let me go ahead and gift an item right over here. Well, we're almost the, the weekend. So here we go. This one, for example, is a really, really cool um, emote. So I'm going to go ahead and gift it to a random subscriber. Three, two, one one and randomly there we go best gamer four five six thank you for being a subscriber hope you enjoy this item and without further ado let's get right into the fortnite xp glitch so here we go map code is going to be on the screen it's going to be nine zero six two following that will be three three seven one and following that will be ninety forty two press accept and on the screen you guys will find fire versus water click on this map click select and click play but please do make sure that you go into a private game if for some reason you guys load into a public game then this is not gonna work you guys are either not even gonna get xp or you're gonna get really the bare minimum amount so here we go we're now loading in super exciting guys let me know what level you are at i'm level 149 on this account now i know i mentioned this a few times but the reason why i'm not like level 200 or 300 is because i do xp glitch maps on other accounts as well since there is a limit per day so i can do all of them in the same account if not I would be like level 400 500 by now so go ahead and start the game you guys are going to be teleported in this really cool map so it's going to be kind of like avatar themed fire versus water it's going to be really really cool i haven't shown you guys this map a lot only maybe once or twice in the past but this time it's going to be brand new everything is going to be new and updated so once you are inside of the map there's going to be a three second timer and what we're going to want to do is go to the vault over there now to get there you guys are going to follow me right like this just like that you guys are going to glide and you guys are going to be brought here now it's going to say like and favorite so if you guys want to support this map you guys can do it over here that would be much appreciated once you guys are right over here in front of this vault there's going to be a button over here in this left side however in order to activate this button i think we need to do an emote somewhere over here so let me just double check exactly where it is so there we go okay so it's going to be over here i think we have to do like an emote over here over here not quite sure but anyways once you found this button you're going to interact with it and it is going to bring us to this room there's going to be a 900 second timer now although it does seem like it is a long time what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna go do some other stuff and then come back so i'm probably gonna end up waiting even longer than what this is which i do recommend you guys do if you want more xp so 900 seconds and i'll be back very very soon all right guys so the timer is now over now remember that we will be covering two different maps in this video so stay until the end so the code right over here is going to be one two three four five six seven eight nine after this you guys are gonna put in one two three four five six after this two and then the last number is going to be one two three four once you guys have put this in final code is going to be nine thousand six hundred and twenty four and once you guys have put this in nine six two four you're going to press on the interact button right over here and it is going to teleport you guys to this spot now as you guys can see this location is the same as the first video of the day however the buttons are going to be hidden in different spots so don't worry about that it's not going to be the same at all all of the buttons are going to be in different spots so for the first glitch you're gonna follow me frontwards just like i'm doing and we are gonna go all the way to the chair that is floating over here once you guys are at the chair you're gonna go ahead and jetpack to it so just like that you're gonna run forward just like i'm doing and as soon as you guys are right in front you're gonna go ahead and just do the jetpack and then right over here on the chair will be the first button once you've interacted with this as you can see we're already at 3100 3400 5000 6000 7 8 9 almost what almost 10,000 xp let's go the next button you're gonna follow me forward and we're gonna go um inside the same thing like that so basically same thing as we did earlier you guys are going to follow me inside now once you are over here you're going to go ahead and take a left just like this and once you have taken a left so not over here but over here you're going to take a left and then right over here you guys are going to find this small um this small thing over here the small fire pit you can interact with the button and as you can see again we are earning more xp so obviously the xp is going up pretty slow in this map however trust me stay until the end because it's just going to get faster and faster as the glitches go by follow me forward again and we're going to go to the same place so you're going to go up to this staircase 
Once you've done that, you're gonna find a bigger fire pit over there. This is the small one. We're gonna head to the bigger one. Once you guys are in front of this bigger torch, what we're gonna do is actually go to the right over here and you guys are gonna find this. Once you have found it at the bottom, you guys will find a question mark. So go ahead and interact with it. And as you can see on the screen, we're now at almost 30,000 XP. The next XP glitch, you guys are gonna follow me inside. So just go forward once again. And this glitch is actually gonna be very easy to do. Literally, all you guys have to do once you are over here is jetpack up. And once you guys have jetpacked up, you're gonna find a vase on the right side. So towards the right of the vase will be a button. This is gonna be the next button. It's gonna teleport us back to where I am. And as you can see again, we're now at 35,000, almost 36,000 XP. Let me just turn this off real quick so that people stop spamming me, awesome. Once you guys are right over here, we're gonna go forward once again. And as soon as you guys have gone forward, we are gonna keep on going just like this. Keep on going, keep on going. And as soon as you guys are over here, you're gonna look for that kind of chandelier. Once you have found it, we're gonna jetpack to the top just like I'm doing. And once you guys are right over here, you're gonna follow me to this character. You're gonna find a fire pit. The button is not gonna be on the fire pit. It's actually gonna be over here on this part of the wall. You're gonna interact with this button. And again, this is gonna grant you guys a lot of XP. I meant to say the stands, not the wall. Anyways, once you guys are over here, we're gonna go towards the left side and you guys are gonna find this over here. Once you have found it, we're gonna go inside and then once you guys are in the middle over here on the water, you're gonna look up and as soon as you guys look up, you will find a button right over here. And now are you guys ready for the last XP glitch of this map? It's gonna be really insane. Then we're gonna be going into the next map. Now make sure you guys grab yourself a new jetpack. Um, I kind of finished mine almost, so grab a new one. And now for this glitch, we're gonna jetpack all the way to the top. So I'm pretty sure that for this glitch, you guys will most definitely need a, um, a jetpack. Now you won't be able to do it. So follow me over here. And then just keep on running and we're gonna go all the way to the other side over here where i'm pickaxing at once you guys are right over here you're gonna follow me until the end just like this and right over here you guys will find a button that says farm once you've interacted with this button you're gonna be brought over here grab yourselves as many of these explosive goo guns as you would like to and the more you guys eliminate these the more xp that you will be given as you can see on the screen and i have 55,000 xp that is not bad at all so you guys could actually go ahead and exit the farm just like this and now let's Let's head into the next map all right so we're now over here now what you're gonna do next is search up the next map it's gonna be 1v1 pro wars just like this once you've searched it up you're gonna find this map you guys could click on it press select press play and do make sure though for this one that you guys load into a private game and as soon as we are inside i'll show you guys exactly what to do so it's actually gonna be very very simple inside of this map there's going to be an xp farm that we're gonna be able to do and it's gonna be pretty crazy once you are inside of the map right over here you're gonna turn around and then we're gonna grab ourselves some smgs you guys could grab as many as you would like to then you're gonna go ahead and exit this part we're gonna head to the right side where it says vault and once you guys are in front of the vault we're gonna build one floor to the left of it so right over here build one floor then do literally any emote interact with the button in this corner and this is gonna bring you guys over here now go ahead and eliminate these bots now although you guys will not see any xp on your screen some of you might see but probably won't be because the map doesn't have xp yet so you guys could go ahead and do this and the longer you guys do this the more xp you will get so although you don't have xp on your screens xp will still be added to your account once the map gets calibrated so probably in just like two three hours you guys are going to see on your screens that you actually got xp for doing this farm so i know it might sound weird that like you guys are doing this and you're not getting xp but trust me it's going to be worth doing since you're actually still going to be getting it so thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed please go ahead and like and favor this map that would be awesome like and like and subscribe to the video and i'll see you all in the next one. Peace.